Hey guys, Bear Love and welcome back to Let's Play Persona 4. In the last episode, we met a, well, we kind of met Kanji. I guess you can call it met. We kind of stalked him more than anything, but yeah, we met Kanji and we believe he is the one on the TV, uh, the Midnight Channel, and yeah, we're devising a plan to save him or spy on him some more. We got a stakeout, but tonight we can't really do anything, so we're just going to head to bed and get ready for the stakeout. Yeah, let's... Head to bed, because we gotta be prepped and ready to run. Run like a madman. Because Kanji beats biker gangs up. And biker gangs will probably kill us, so. Oh man. Here we go. I got the stake out prepped and ready here. Has the target arrived at school? <laughs> nope. Yes, ma'am. Visual ID confirmed. Oh man. Target arrived in zone near the end of his mess break, with mother issued rations in hand. Mothered issue rations. We even going we're going like all out here. This is a cheese idea, I know it. Current status in the bathroom fixing his hair. Oh wow. The target was acting nervous. I left my position before he had a chance to pick on me. Hey. <laughs> oh my god. Just I can't stress it enough how much I love these guys. I wonder what kind of plans they made. It didn't seem like he knew that boy very well. No, not really. I guess they just kind of met that day. Well, I think there's something more subtle. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe it's... Maybe it has nothing to do with anything. Hmm. Oh, he's here. Maybe it's something... Oh. Special meeting. Oh, man. That hair. He fixed it up nice. <gasps> and Spiffy Pants Boy is here. I didn't keep you waiting, I hope. Hmm. No, I, uh, I just got here too. Hmm. They didn't notice us. Hiding spot was a success. Oh yeah. What in the world was that? That was... I don't know. Hoodie's textbook meet up there. them or we'll lose them all right that's it all okay then let's split up into two groups one team will follow kanji and the other will stake out the shop hmm how's your plan dibs on the shop roger that how should we split the teams hmm it's a good question pair with yosuke pair with shie pair with yukiko uh that these really have um any significance like which one you want to go with. But, regardless of who you choose, we're going with Yukiko. Why not, right? Sure, that's fine with me. Yeah, no boys and girls team. Going co ed. Oh man, they're almost out of sight. Come on, Yosuke. Aha, I made the teams. So I'm pairing up with Chie? Okay. Alright, All right, let's do this. We'll need to pretend we're on a date to make it look natural. There you go, Yosuke. Now you're using your head. Oh, not in a million years. There'll be no need for that if we stay out of sight. <laughs> oh, yeah, at least you tried. You gotta give him the man a... Give the man credit for trying. Oh, sh let's hurry up and go. <laughs> oh, well, looks like me and you should go. I wonder if those two will be alright. I'm sure they'll be fine. What about us? <laughs> um, that leaves us in charge of staking out the textile shop. Hmm, very observant of you. So, shall we? <laughs> Let's shall. <laughs> not, the, probably not the best response to that, but all right, time for some alone time with Yukiko. Aw, oh, yeah. Take that, Yosuke. We got there. Ooh. Sorry about the wait. This one's for you. <laughs> Can't have a steak out without a beer, right? Oh. We're underage still. Everything seems fine at the shop. I hope it stays mm. that way. Well, hopefully no gunman comes up or something like that. Do you think the culprit will come? Hmm, I don't know. I'm sure of it. No worries. I got you. Damn. Do you think too the much culprit of a coward. Um I I'm sure of it. We got this though. Then we need to keep our eyes open. Just lying to Yukiko. Nothing's gonna happen. Nothing ever happens. It would be scary if the culprit did show up. 
Don't worry, I run faster than you, so I'm not worried. But if they do, I'll do what I can to help you catch them. <laughs> Throw your beer at them. You all saved my life. I don't want to be the only one doing nothing. Hmm. I know. You can seduce them, and I'll come in and do something. Hit them, hit them in the head with my can. I mean, I'm sure there's something I can do. Oh, don't worry. There'll be something you can do once we get to the TV world. Not here, though. You're useless here. Oh, sorry. It's like she responded to me there. No, she got me a drink. I went on and on without realizing. I, I guess I'm a little nervous. Oh, uh, we are standing in the middle of the open, so if anything does happen, we are pretty open. I've never chatted with a boy my age like this before. Oh. Oh, you're worried about that? Oh. She, of course, has no problem getting along with guys because of her personality. Hmm. Well, everybody seems to hit on you. All the guys, anyways. Don't worry, I'm I different. she's had more fun hanging out with you and Yosuke lately. Oh. <laughs> hmm. What are you getting at? I think the I know. Same is true for me. Oh, now I see. Hmm. Oh, I see where we're going with this. Guess where we are going with this. Get the voice ready. What oh, that weird symbol. Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou hast established a new bond. It brings thee closer to the truth. Thou shall be blessed when creating personas of the priestess Arcana. Oh yeah, new social link. Yukiko, oh yeah. Yukiko Amagi. Sweet. So they'll always be able to take a mortal blow for you. That's always good. Oh yeah. Oh. Ask a share. Ask a share. What's your number, babe? Huh? Uh, okay, if you want. I think you actually have to have a certain amount of courage to say that as well. Apparently I had enough, though. I didn't think I would have enough to say that. Can't always answer since I help out around the inn, but feel free to call any time. Ah, I think I will. Be like Yosuke and tell you perverted jokes in the middle of the night. No, I won't do that. Oh yeah. So this is pretty much just a date with Yukiko, even though we were just standing around talking awkwardly. Got the job done. That shop was staked out. Now let's go see what Yosuke and Chie are up to. Oh man. How's that jacket staying on his shoulders? Whoa, 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 what are you two doing? Man, this is weird. You're telling me. Yeah, we definitely stand out. <laughs> Those hiding spots. No, I mean them. I get, I get this weird feeling about them. Hmm. What could it be? Weird? What about them's weird? <laughs> what isn't weird about them? Um, I don't know how to put it. Kanji's a guy who beats up Vikings. The other guy wouldn't even know anything about him besides his pants look pretty spiffy. Oh, well, maybe it's just my imagination. Maybe. Hmm. Hey, how do you think the others are doing? We're doing just fine. Don't worry about us. Beats me. For all we know, he's hitting on Yukiko as we speak. Damn, you read me like a book. <laughs> Damn, Yosuke, he's good. Yeah, no. He's not like you. Oh, that's what you'd like to think. Yukiko doesn't seem to be interested in that stuff anyway. That's what you'd like to think as well. Wait, are you saying he's interested in her? Yosuke, cover for me, man. Huh? I, I, I wouldn't know. Ah. Oh. We don't really talk about that kind of stuff. <laughs> Except for the last night when you called me and asked. <laughs> now I'm even more suspicious. You know something, don't you? <laughs> Aren't you guys supposed to be staking out Kanji and the other guy with the spiffy pants? I seriously don't know. It's not like we've been hanging out that long. <laughs> Why don't you call me at night and tell me perverted jokes? Never mind. That's not a terrible. Do not do that, Yosuke. It's terrible. Uh oh. What the hell are you two doing? Oh god, they've been spotted. Cover blown. Oh jeez. Oh well, you see, we're we're just two crazy lovebirds. Oh, good cover, Yosuke. It always works. Ugh. Uh, what do you mean, bird? 
You mean Burr Dragons? Play along, Burr Brain. <laughs> uh oh. Didn't I see you guys yesterday? Oh God, he's on to us. <laughs> Come on, it just so happened that we were walking behind you guys. Pure coincidence. It's true. Hey, our houses are just over that way, so we'll be going now. Uh oh. Time to get out of here. Um, look, we weren't planning on getting in your guys' way, and, and there's nothing strange about it either. No, I... oh, what do you shut up, Chie? S strange. Uh oh. I think we might have hit an oaf. Why can't you keep your big mouth shut? <laughs> uh oh. Whoa, 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 wait. Oh, God. Damn it. Oh, you pissed them off. Oh, God. Say what you think. You, you got it all wrong. <laughs> that escape plan. Tire him out. Run in circles. Hey, are you listening, damn it? You gotta give him the jukes. It seriously ain't like that. He's thinking about something else. She and Yosuke would just try to get away from him, talking about the investigations. I think there's something else on his mind. I don't know. Something seems fishy here. Oh. We regret to inform that our mission failed. Yes, yes, yes it did. Don't worry, ours was successful. There was nowhere to hide. <laughs> oh god. Oh, they tried to hide behind the tree. Well, let's wait here a little longer. Maybe Kanji-kun will come home. Kanji-kun? I'll probably end up calling him that yeah. all the time. I don't know if that's the right, um, what's the, what's the, oh yeah, honorific to be using for me to kanji, but, I don't know. Kanji can always get stuck in my head whenever I think of kanji. Kanji can. Oh god, there he is. Huh? What are you guys doing here? Well, it appears that he's still pissed. Uh-oh. You're those stupid lovebirds I just saw. <laughs> stupid lovebirds. <laughs> oh god. We are not a couple. Making it straight, just making sure he knows. Why are you assholes following me around? You said a bad word. Damn it, what the hell's going on? Uh oh. I ain't saying this is you guys' fault. Hmm. But damn it! Hmm. Something's eating at him. Now's a chance. Hey, uh, mind if we ask something? Has anything strange happened to you lately? Uh oh. I don't think it's the thing to say. Huh? Strange? Hmm. What's this strange stuff, huh? Are uh -oh. you saying that I'm strange? Definitely not the right words to use. Huh? No, no, no. I, I didn't mean. Uh oh. We pissed him off again. You shitheads better get the hell out of my face or I'm taking you down! <laughs> oh god. Time to run. What? Wait, why? Oh god. I look like I'm choking! He's pissed! Run! Yosuke <laughs> runs into the door. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> Too much running. <sighs> yeah. We probably just like, like ran down the street. A little tired out. Well, nothing happened today, so I guess everything's okay. Yeah, we failed. But it's already been a few days since he appeared on the Midnight Channel. That's uh, true. If this is anything like Yukiko's case, it'll happen soon. Hmm. Well, what can we do? We, all we do is piss him off. Then we can't let our guard down. I think we should come back tomorrow to check up on him. Yeah, just keep, keep an eye on him and try to stay away and not piss him off anymore. Looks like we've got no choice. Hmm. Let's go home. I'm wiped. Jeez, all this running around, all this fail. Well, I succeeded in my objective. I got Yukiko's number. The stakeout went without a hitch. Everything went better than expected. And we get welcome. Oh, nope, I'm fine. Alright, so there's nothing else we can really do here. Started a awesome social link. Talk to Nanako, see what she has to say. Oh, yeah. Don't join. Stay, stay a good girl. You keep the house so clean and tidy. This is this is Nanako's house. This isn't Dojima's house. Nanako runs this, runs this house. 
Yeah, we might as well. Yes, nothing, nothing else we can do tonight. But it's raining, so guess what that means. It's time for the one and only. Midnight Channel. Peep, 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 peep. Hello? Hello? Oh. It's Yukiko. I'm sorry to call so late. Oh, no problem. Uh, Kanji-kun seems to be missing. Kanji-kun? Missing? The? Oh, you didn't say the. Never mind. I had some calls to make for the inn, so I called the textile shop as well. Ah, this late at night? When I spoke to Kanji-kun's mother, hmm. she told me that he'd left the house and hasn't returned since. Uh oh. She did say that this happens all the time, but what do you think? Hmm. Well, it is raining right now. It sounds bad. What do we do? I think so too. He could be. Well, not much we can do now. It's nighttime. It's going to rain again tonight. Maybe the midnight channel will come on. It's going to rain. I hear it pouring outside. Hmm, that's true. I'll make sure to check out the TV at midnight. Talk to you later. Later. Ah, uh, that's it. Can't talk about other things. Damn. Maybe next time. But it's time for the midnight channel. And get ready. We're about to see some crazy stuff. Oh man, here we go. Oh man, this is gonna be. One wacky time. I I believe this is it anyways. I'm pretty sure this is the time we're gonna see some we're gonna see some crazy stuff tonight. Prepare your bodies. Here we go. Uh oh. It's Kanji. Hello, dear viewers. It's time for bad bad bathhouse. I think we got the wrong channel here. What? Tonight I'll introduce a superb sight for those searching for sublime love that surpasses the separation of the sexes. Are you sure this is the midnight channel? I think we might have one of those dirty late night channels. Oh god, what's happening? Oh, what the? I'm your host, Kanji Tatsumi, serving you this scandalously special sneak in report. Oh god. Goodness gracious, just imagine the things that might happen to me there. <laughs> just the way he says goodness gracious just makes me... Oh, it's, just, it's funny. Oh my god. It's getting... Well then, let's get this show on the road. Toodaloo! What the hell? What kind of walk is that? Like a monkey. Oh god. Well, this took a really weird turn. Now, ah, what's going on? <laughs> what the hell? Oh, God. Snap out of it, man. Easy. Easy, bro. But that was completely over the top. <sighs> I don't know. No, it really was Kanji. I don't know, man. I have no idea what's going on. Wait out in the rain, screw that. Well, I guess this confirms it. Oh god, I have a few ideas. Oh god, I don't think you want to get it, bro. Anyways, we better hurry and come up with a plan tomorrow. Oh god. I don't like where this is going. Go to bed. God, I think I'd want to sleep up seeing something like that. So, I guess that confirms Condi has entered the TV. But what he has entered into? Oh, good God. That kid's squatting in the corner. What's he doing over there? <sighs> Man. Given the pattern so far, Kanji's already inside the TV. That would appear to be the case. <clears throat> I wonder what the Midnight Channel really is. Hmm. That's a very good question that'll probably be answered way later in the game. Maybe. Hmm. A 
first I thought it was one of those paranormal things, but when I gave it a try, it, it was real. Maybe it still is one of those paranormal things. Just, it, it exists. Turns out it's actually connected to another world. Mm hmm If there's a rumor going around, that means a bunch of people are watching it. Oh god, how many people's lives were scud because of what they saw last night? How did the rumor go? If you stare into a turned off TV on a rainy night. Hmm. No one in their right mind would try something that ridiculous, don't you think? Unless someone urged them to. You know, all four of us just did it. But if Without you actually try, it does work. And not just once. Hmm. If this rumor spreads and everyone starts watching the Midnight Channel. Oh god. Everyone will see things they don't want to see. Oh god. It could cause a huge panic. Yeah, definitely what we saw last night could cause a huge panic. You right, Chie. Good god. The children. If Teddy is right, the missing people themselves create the stuff we see. Yeah, we have to think of the children in this situation. So it's not random. It's specifically related to whoever goes missing. That would appear to be the case. But why? <sighs> Yukiko had a show too, but she doesn't remember doing anything like that. Hmm. I have a hunch. Um, this might be a little off subject, but... Hmm? The culprit is probably watching the shows that come on, right? That is a good point. If we can watch it, so can he. Hmm. No doubt. He's probably sitting back and enjoying... Oh, God. Sitting back and enjoying it? Dear God, no. No, we can't be dealing with that kind of person. No, please, no. Wait a sec. I bet he is enjoying it. Oh, God, no. <gasps> He's probably laughing his head off watching the show that comes on after he throws people into the TV. Hmm. That could be... That could be reasonable, I guess. I was thinking of something else, but... Carry on. Oh, I get it. Yeah, it's definitely possible. Hmm. Ugh. Now when I think of the killer, I get this image of a total sicko. Well, you thought murdering people wasn't already total sicko? I don't know, man. I want to see everything about you, Yuki-chan. <laughs> Sounds like you. Oh god. Wait, so if people saw Yukiko's show, do you think people were watching what happened to me too? That is a good point. We didn't see Chie on the Minute Channel, we just she just kinda ran into a shadow. Oh, that is it! Oh. That killer is dead meat. I'm gonna leave footprints all over his face. Oh man. We're not gonna blame TV will though? Guys! First we save Kanji, then we crush the killer. I kind of, I like how we're just talking about this like really loud and nobody around in the classroom is just kind of wondering like what the hell are those four talking about? It's like... Finally we crush the killer and send him to hell! Got it? Oh, jeez. <laughs> Take it easy, Che. You're gonna turn to a killer. Jeez. I like the motivation, but... <laughs> using the drive of murder to continue on? That works. <gasps> oh yeah, you, you probably forgot that this is actually the social link, the investigation team. Oh yeah, that motivation. Getting those links. You actually don't, there's not many fool personas <laughs> in the game. Well, I found anyways, but there's a lot of personas in the game. I definitely won't be getting them all, there's just a lot of them. It takes a long time to get them all. Chie, those last two were the same thing. <laughs> oh, good old Yukio is laughing at Chie. <laughs> Trying to be serious. Uh, I know. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, in we go. The time has come. To find out what's going on in here. I would love... Teddy's like little tail is like wiggling. Hey Teddy, someone's his here, ears, right? His ears and his tail is wiggling. Oh, yep, I think someone's here. 
Ah, you, you seem a little down, Teddy. You think? Uh, do you know where he is? Hmm. I don't know. Hmm. What? We think it's a boy named Kanji. Kanji Kun. I don't know. Come on, Teddy. What the hell? See, no motivation. What's going on here? Hmm, what's wrong? Not feeling well? Hmm. Well, I sniff and I sniff, but I still can't tell where the smell comes from. Broken nose. He has a cold. Aren't you thinking too much about too many things? Hmm. I mean, last time you were wondering about who you really are and how long you've been here. Deep in thought inside here. What else can you do when you're alone 24 hours a day, 7 days a week? In a foggy shadow world. Your head's empty to begin with, dude. Don't stress out over stuff too much. Hmm, I don't know. It seems to be bothering him a lot. You're right. Hmm, poor Teddy. Man. That tail, Whoa, though. He's seriously down about this. Yeah, you okay? Show a little more compassion. If you can't figure out where Kanji is, we're in deep trouble. Uh oh. We can't just wander around aimlessly in a place like this. We could. Might be bad. I know what might help. You should give me a clue about this Kanji person. Ah, a clue. It's just a feeling I have. I think I could concentrate better with it. What do you mean by clue? Do you have anything that could give me a good understanding of him? Uh, nope. Something about Kanji, huh? I can't really think of anything besides all the rumors about him. He fights biker gangs and doesn't afraid of anything. That's about it. Yeah, it's not like we know him that well. Uh-oh, that's not good. I just need some sort of hint. Something that tells me what he's really like. Yukiko, you used to know him as a kid. Why don't we ask around and find people who know Kanji-kun personally? That's also a good option. Oh yeah. Hmm, time to go scout out. Hmm. Time to learn more about Kanji. I like the, this part of the game, kind of. But also, it's kind of a black. So this part of the game is kind of weird because now we have to go around town and talk to a bunch of NPCs, like the just the random people walking around to ask for information about Kanji. So you could go around talking to each and every person in town if you don't know like who to talk to, which kind of sucks. Like, yeah, it kind of. It, when I first did this, I, I was really actually kind of annoyed with this part, like going around talking to every NPC. Because it's not just one person you're looking for, it's usually like a trail of people. You find one person, they'll say, oh, maybe this person knows, and you go talk to that person. Oh, maybe this person knows. It's like that kind of deal. And you're like walking around, and it's kind of annoying. But I know who to talk to and all that, but... We're a little... Yeah, we're getting a little high on time here, because even after this, we'll have a big cutscene inside the TV world once we bring, report back to Captain Teddy, so... I am just gonna end this one off here. We'll go to the, the shopping district. Listen to the music. Oh man, this music. For those of you who haven't yet, like this soundtrack, man. I know it's hard to listen to, especially with my dumb voice over it all the time. But definitely, this soundtrack is probably one of my favorite soundtracks of any game, really. And I think I've mentioned this before, but like the remixes of these songs, mm mm, man, I enjoy me some of this music. It's like, ugh, I listen to it all the time, like, when I'm just, like, sitting around on my computer. It's like, definitely look it up on YouTube or wherever you might find this music, but definitely listen to it. It's awesome. It's all awesome. But, anyways, I've dragged you on long enough. We're gonna go chase this little girl. Hello, little girl. Tell me where Kanji is. No, I haven't. Oh, no, this is something else. Shut up, I don't want to talk to you. But, we're gonna chill with this garbage can. Not you can go. This guy of the game. Anyway, so I'm going to end that video off here. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. And next time, yeah, we're going to get in some pretty deep stuff. Next episode, yeah, we're definitely going to learn more about Kanji. The new character Kanji-kun. <laughs> I'm going to feel dumb if, like, calling him Kanji-kun makes it seem really weird. I don't know. I just, I always get it stuck on my head to call him Kanji-kun because Yukiko does it. Damn it. Anyways, alright. So, yeah. See you guys next time.
Later, guys.